Here with Jariah Davis of Point Park Men's Track and Field. Jariah, uh, good indoor season. How are you guys feeling going into outdoor this weekend? Uh, uh, it's a good it's a good season so far. Uh, I know the snow just came, so I know throwers can't throw this weekend, but um, it's a good way to start the meet. You know, get everyone ready, get everyone excited. You know, everyone has like this best two three weeks off now. So well, not off completely, but like no meets, no nothing. So it's finally like getting back into track. Is it hard to get yourself ready, um, basically practicing indoors with the winter months uh, lingering on here still? Uh, it's a little difficult, but um, there's no obstacles that we can't overcome. There's a lot of uh, obstacles in track that, you know, there might be bad weather during a meet. You might run in snow, might run in rain, might run in really, really windy co conditions. You never know. It might be really hot one day. So um, it's good to prepare, prepare in any condition possible. So the Point Park men's and women's teams both won the indoor conference championship. So far in the first three years, they've come up runner-up in the outdoor season. Uh, does right. that give you confidence to maybe take first place this year? And what are your chances as a couple of teams? Yes, I believe we do have a great chance no matter what. Our team has grown a lot since uh, my freshman, sophomore, and junior year. So we have a lot of uh, new freshmen that have potential to definitely put in some great work coming into this new outdoor season um, and a lot of returners that are willing and want to win. Um, we don't like second place, we don't like losing. Um, so we're ready, we've been putting in the work and we're ready to come and get first place. And so yourself, a multi-time All-American, you're at the indoor and outdoor nationals pretty much every time. Um, and you've, with each passing year, it seems like you're joined by more and more teammates there. Uh, do you feel like in your senior year, this might be an outdoor season where you're going to have a, a lot of uh, people there at Nationals for yes. Point Park? I do, yes, 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 for sure. Um, we have great, great talent, great talent all around the board, cross country, coming into track for our distance uh, team, um, jumpers as well, throwers have definitely a possibility. Um, I, I believe it's just mentally, it's mentally focused. People need, um, our team needs to be mentally focused and also be able to understand that they have the chance to do it. Uh, don't be down on themselves or anything like that. Um, like, our, like I said, Anna Shields, of course, is always in the go. She's amazing. We have another possibility in our long jump, Andre, Andre Lowry. He hit a uh, six, eight, nine, very close to indoor. Um, I know that's personally been hitting him a little harder than normal, so I know he's willing and wants to qualify for outdoor nationals. And I know there's a lot of freshmen um, like Reba and Alyssa who came to indoor nationals that, you know, they got the experience of the feel of indoor nationals. And so I know that's something that motivates everybody. Um, and I, I hope to see as many as possible for my team to make it to nationals. And lastly, we're going to get into your event, uh, your events, the jumps. And talk about this jumps crew for the Pioneers. It seems like there's so many guys, be it high jump, long jump, triple jump, five or six guys that are uh, all conference caliber, national type qual caliber. Does that keep you motivated every day and you're always competing against each other? Yes, yes. We always compete against each other no matter what, even in practice, at meets. It's a friendly competition. There's nothing serious. I mean, we always brag on each other or um, say we're going to beat each other every other meet or every practice. Every little thing we do, we always compete against each other, which is nice. It's a friendly competition, which is amazing to have um, within a team. Um, it pushes us. It truly does. I mean, there's Sean Barry who's pushed me every single year. I mean, without that, without him, I don't think I would be where I am today. He's, I truly, truly can't thank him enough. Um, Michael Morse, he definitely, you know, we call on him. We tell him, you know, we want to see you in national. So we're pushing each other in a very competitive way, and I'm, I'm glad to see where the jump squad has come. Thanks a lot, Dry. Good luck this outdoor season. We'll be following you. All right. Thank you so much.